In tonight's State of the Capitol, following financial trouble, the future of Henderson State University has been in the balance for months, with massive budget cuts and layoffs alerting the school. But today, the governor made clear he believes Henderson still can make the grade. Kate Renee Saf is live at the Capitol with what he said and what the future looks like for the struggling university. Kate Renee. Yeah, well, you know, the bottom line of this news conference today is that Henderson is trying to rebrand, and they're doing so by focusing on meeting students where they're at in a changing world. It's a plan that the governor says he wholeheartedly supports, and one the, the school hopes will help them get back on track. It's a complicated form of arithmetic. A university in the red plus decrease enrollment equals an uncertain future. But now, thank you for uh, joining us today. University and state leaders believe it's a problem they can solve. Today, I wanted to express my full confidence, uh, my support, and excitement about the future of Henderson State University. After a trend of budget cuts and layoffs, Henderson State University is looking to evolve. Together with partners, we have the opportunity to partner with Henderson State University in reimagining what education can look like in the future. Paving a new way for students. 80% of American college students are not traditional coming out of high school, living in residence halls, uh, completing college in four years. Chancellor Chuck Ambrose says the rebranding will focus on workforce development, catering to a non-traditional student wanting a new kind of learning. We've got the ingredients. We can do it different. Um, and if our focus is on students, the outcomes will be better. It's a change the university hopes will save ship and one current students see as the only way forward. I'm you know, willing to adjust for change. Robert Dunham is preparing to graduate, hoping to use his football experience for a new career. He's been through the school's financial woes and stayed put for one reason. The people that around you that support you don't just leave that. It's because of things changing around you. A focus on students that Ambrose hopes will become Henderson's brand. So the next math problem can be Henderson plus Arkansas equals success. Now, as for those students currently enrolled in the university, Ambrose says that they're already adapting to the change and that this should take time to be put into effect so it shouldn't be too much of a change for those students. He does say, however, that this will just give them more opportunities in the future as opposed to less. Reporting at the Capitol, Kate Renee Saf, back to you.